welcome back to Heather's Crafty Classroom and Merry Christmas Eve. Today is Christmas Eve, I can't believe it, but I wanted to tell you, or show you, sorry, um, the final book of my fun mini album tutorial series that I was doing. So I just wanted to get on here real quick and do a final walkthrough. So this is the final book. Now this measures four and a half by eight. Sorry, my nose is running all of a sudden by eight and it has a one and a half inch spine, which I left blank. I don't, I just was in the mood. Um, and it's a little chunkier than, than I thought it was going to be, but it's still good. It still has plenty of room for pictures. So I put this satin ribbon on that was green, but it wasn't like green, green, but I thought it looked really cute with it. And this is using the Tula and Norbert's Christmas party by photo play. And I got it at Tuesday morning last week or the week before. So it's really, really cute. I had never had Tula and Norbert anything before. And I got the Va a Valentine's one too, so I'm excited. So over on this page, um, I have a double pocket. So there's this pocket in this pocket. It says, hey Santa, with them in the car. And then in here it has two photo mats. And this one is just a square. Um, it sits, fits a four by four, and then this one is a little booklet that holds two by threes. So cute. And look at that little car. And then I also put this little pom-pom trim that was in my sash, and I thought it matched perfectly. And then in the top, I have this big, huge tag, and I stapled on some ribbon and left the back plain so you could do what you want there. So on the first page, it has this little guy. So sorry. Um, this little guy says, I still believe. And there's a little tabby here so you know to pull it open. And it's got a magnet. So this one opens this way. And this is open. So you can put another put photo there. Photos here. Photos here. And this is open as well. So you want to tuck something under there. And then this one is a pull tab. So it says, happy holidays with the snowman. And you pull this and it opens up for four by four photos. And it's really like glides really easy. It's so nice. All right. And then it's only one signature. The whole book is one signature. So it's not real big. But holds tons and tons of photos. So this one is um, these two little chipboard elements. And this is naughty and nice. These were from Scrap Diva Designs. Just one of the little dies I got. I didn't get to play with much. I was kind of running out of time, but that's okay. Um, and I put these on foam too. So I don't know if you can tell, I put some white fun foam underneath. And it's super easy. You just cut it out once with the paper and then cut it out again with the fun foam. And then this one unties down here. It says December 25th. And then it, can I fit it? pops open into frame and these are also holds um four by four four by four photos you can also put one up here and then down here at the bottom i put this little house but it is open so if you wanted to tuck a little something you could so there's that so cute and then the last page is on the back cover it has this little guy he's popped up on foam it says merry christmas and opens up opens up photos here <clears throat> these open and you've got a couple little cute little tags just for decoration you can always journal on the back with a white pen this one is a little booklet naughty or nice and you can put photos this one has a journaling spot holiday memories and then I just put white on the back so you can put another photo a four by four photo mat and then a four by six and that is it. This turned out so cute. I just thought it was the paper. I've never worked with this paper. And then the back, of course, I had to do the hexagons. Um, let's see if it's there. The hexagons with all the different prints of paper and my cute little logo. So that's it, you guys. I hope you like this book. This um, was a lot of fun to make. I wanted to show you guys. This is a third one like this, so I thought I should show you guys how I did it. I really enjoy this style because it holds a little, quite a few pictures, but it's not real huge and doesn't take up a bunch of time. 
So, all right, you guys. I hope you guys have a good Merry Christmas. Enjoy your time with your loved ones. I'll talk to you soon, okay? Bye, everyone.